My name is Sara Itzi and I'm one of the co-founders of The Lost Avocado Project. Today we are here in the beautiful island of Malta to shoot the latest episode of our Lost Teen videos. And this time we joined forces with DJI, who gave us a chance to use the new Roniness. In travel and documentary filmmaking, it's essential to keep your equipment as light and compact as possible, so you can take it anywhere you go. The Ronin S is compact enough to fit in a small backpack, so I can quickly take it out and use it on the fly. The action in this type of filmmaking is not scripted, so the moment that I'm looking for might only happen once, and there's no way to tell where or when. Most importantly, it is impossible to repeat the scene, so you only have one chance to capture it. The responsiveness of the Ronin S, thanks to its sports mode and the ability to instantly change between different user modes, is really helpful when shooting in an unscripted and unpredictable environment. We cannot afford to spend too much time on a single location, but at the same time, we don't want to compromise our creative vision. The Ronin S allows us to capture perfectly stable, beautiful dynamic shots in different situations, whether that's running up the stairs in the city, shooting from a moving boat, or even running in a rocky terrain. The Ronin S makes it possible to capture complex scenes, like the tracking shot that we filmed in the old city. We use the Ronin S mounted to a monopod for a jeep arm type of shot. Easily mounting the camera on and off the gimbal using the industry standard mounting plate allowed us to take the camera off the Ronin S for taking a still photo and putting it back quickly again. This especially turned out to be handy in situations where we needed both still images and video. We've tested the time-lapse feature of the Ronin S, programming complex camera movements easily via the Ronin app. Working with the Ronin S was a great experience. We managed to be much faster, create new dynamic shots, and I'm really looking forward to working with it again in the future.